Breaking news from SpaceX's Starbase. In a groundbreaking development that could reshape the future of space exploration, the FAA has just made a historic announcement about Starship launches. What started as a limit of five launches per year could soon become 25. That's a launch every two weeks from the Texas facility. The stakes couldn't be higher. With Starship Flight 6 just behind us, SpaceX received news that could accelerate their ambitious plans for the most powerful rocket ever built. We're talking about doubling the upper stage thrust and pushing the boundaries of what's possible in space transportation. But here's what makes this truly extraordinary. The FAA's 160-page assessment doesn't just give SpaceX the green light. It potentially opens the door for catching both stages of the rocket right back at Starbase. That's right. The dream of a fully reusable, super-heavy launch system is closer than ever. Welcome to Elon Musk 24 Hours, where we break down the latest developments in space technology and innovation. Today, we're diving deep into what this FAA announcement really means for the future of Starship, exploring the environmental implications, and revealing when we might see Flight 7 take to the skies. Let's dive right in. The FAA's announcement marks a pivotal moment in SpaceX's journey, but the story behind this decision reveals a dramatic series of events that few people know about. What's about to unfold could completely transform humanity's access to space. Let's start with a shocking revelation. SpaceX has been preparing for this moment for over two years, quietly developing technologies that were considered impossible just a decade ago. The jump from 5 to 25 annual launches isn't just a numerical increase. It's a testament to human ingenuity pushing the boundaries of what's possible. During the entire Apollo program, NASA launched just 11 Saturn V rockets over seven years. SpaceX is now preparing to launch more than twice that number of starships in a single year from Starbase alone. This is the kind of advancement that comes once in a generation. Inside sources at SpaceX reveal a fascinating detail. The company's engineers have been working in three continuous shifts, 24-7, to achieve what many thought impossible. They've reduced launch preparation time by an astounding 85% between flights one and three. What previously took days now requires less than 20 hours of access restrictions per launch, including landing phases. This breakthrough came after a critical moment during Flight 3's preparation when a young engineer proposed a radical new approach to the launch sequence. The environmental assessment tells an equally compelling story. Picture this, a massive logistical operation involving 24,000 annual supply runs, transporting enough liquid oxygen and methane to fill 960 Olympic-sized swimming pools. But here's where SpaceX's innovation shines through. They're not just accepting this challenge, they're revolutionizing it. The proposed water pipeline along Highway 4 isn't just a pipe. It's a testament to forward-thinking engineering that could reduce ground transport by 70%. But here's where the story takes an unexpected turn. While developing Starship 3, SpaceX engineers discovered something extraordinary. The planned upgrade isn't just about doubling the upper stage thrust. They've found a way to potentially achieve what was previously thought impossible. The boost from 74 to 200 meganewtons isn't just a number. It represents the largest single leap in rocket propulsion technology since the space age began. To put this in perspective, this new version of Starship will have enough power to launch a payload equivalent to the weight of three Boeing 747s into orbit. The environmental approval process itself reads like a thriller. Behind the scenes, SpaceX faced numerous challenges that threatened to derail the entire program. The company had to prove that their operations wouldn't harm the delicate ecosystem around Boca Chica. They developed a groundbreaking environmental monitoring system that uses AI to track wildlife movements in real time, automatically adjusting launch preparations to minimize impact. This system has become so sophisticated that other aerospace companies are now requesting to license the technology. The story of reusability takes another dramatic turn. While the public saw a failed catch attempt of the super heavy booster, what they didn't see was the incredible data gathered during those crucial moments. SpaceX engineers discovered that the booster's flight characteristics actually improved during the descent phase, something that defied their computer models. This unexpected finding has led to a complete redesign of the catch mechanism, 
incorporating what they call dynamic stabilization technology. A lesser known fact emerged from the environmental studies. Starship's launch sound levels, while 10 times louder than Falcon 9, created an unexpected opportunity. SpaceX developed a revolutionary sound suppression system that doesn't just reduce noise, it actually converts acoustic energy into usable electricity. This innovation came from a collaborative effort between SpaceX engineers and acoustic scientists who were studying whale communications. The road to Flight 7 has been marked by intense behind-the-scenes preparation. Sources within SpaceX reveal that the company has been running simultaneous simulations on over 1,000 computers, processing more data in a day than NASA did during the entire Apollo program. They've identified optimal launch windows that align with both weather conditions and orbital mechanics, potentially allowing for even more frequent launches than initially planned. The economic implications are staggering, with each Starship launch potentially costing less than $10 million once fully operational, compared to the hundreds of millions required for traditional rockets. We're entering an era where space access could become truly democratized. SpaceX has already begun discussions with various nations about establishing their own spaceports, potentially creating a network of launch facilities around the globe. But perhaps the most exciting development comes from the company's long-term vision. Recent documents suggest that SpaceX isn't just planning Earth-based operations. They're actively developing technologies for in-space refueling and maintenance, effectively creating a network of gas stations in space. This infrastructure could potentially support missions to Mars with much higher payload capacity than previously thought possible. The impact on scientific research cannot be overstated. Universities and research institutions that once had to wait years for a chance to send experiments to space could soon book launches as easily as scheduling a cargo flight. SpaceX has already begun developing a streamlined payload integration process that could reduce preparation time from months to weeks. The company's commitment to safety has led to another breakthrough. They've developed a new emergency abort system for Starship that can protect the payload even in extreme scenarios. This system, tested in secret at their McGregor facility, has performed better than anyone expected, potentially setting new standards for launch vehicle safety. Looking towards the immediate future, Flight 7 represents more than just another launch. It's the culmination of countless innovations each pushing the boundaries of what's possible in space exploration. The launch pad itself has been upgraded with new sensors that can detect and respond to changes in milliseconds, ensuring optimal performance during both launch and landing. What makes this particular moment so crucial is that we're witnessing the birth of a new era in space exploration. SpaceX has not only demonstrated they can launch and recover these massive rockets, but they're also creating an entirely new paradigm for space access. The implications extend far beyond just launching satellites. We're looking at a future where regular trips to orbit could become as common as international flights. As we approach this historic moment, one thing becomes clear. The FAA's decision isn't just about approving more launches. It's about enabling a future that once existed only in science fiction. With these new capabilities, missions to Mars, lunar bases, and even asteroid mining are becoming increasingly realistic possibilities. As we've explored today, the FAA's landmark decision represents far more than just increased launch permissions. It marks the beginning of a new chapter in space exploration. With 25 launches permitted annually and groundbreaking technological advances on the horizon, SpaceX is positioned to transform our access to space in ways previously confined to science fiction. The challenges ahead are significant. From managing environmental impacts to perfecting the revolutionary catch mechanism for both stages. Yet SpaceX's track record of turning the impossible into reality gives us reason for optimism. As we await Flight 7, we're not just watching another rocket launch. We're witnessing the early stages of humanity becoming a truly spacefaring civilization. The implications of these developments will resonate far beyond Starbase potentially revolutionizing everything from scientific research to global communications. With each launch, we move closer to Elon Musk's vision of making life multiplanetary. If you're as excited as we are about these incredible developments in space technology, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to Elon Musk 24 hours. 
share this video with fellow space enthusiasts who need to know about these groundbreaking changes. Drop a comment below with your thoughts on when we might see Flight 7 take to the skies. I read every comment and love hearing your predictions. Don't forget to hit that notification bell to stay updated on the latest SpaceX developments. This is Elon Musk 24 Hours, where we bring you the future of space exploration, one story at a time. In the fast-paced world of technological innovation, Tesla has just made a game-changing announcement that's sending ripples through the robotics industry. The Optimus humanoid robot has achieved a breakthrough that puts it in a league of its own, showcasing capabilities that were previously thought impossible. Elon Musk's vision of 10 billion humanoid robots within 25 years is becoming more tangible by the day. At a revolutionary price point of just $20,000 to $25,000, these advanced machines are set to transform our daily lives. Tesla's engineering team has unlocked extraordinary features that make Optimus the most advanced humanoid robot on the planet. The latest tests reveal stunning performance metrics, 95% autonomous navigation in complex environments, lightning-fast 20 millisecond response times, and an impressive eight-hour operational capacity on a single charge. With Tesla planning to roll out at least a thousand units next year, we're witnessing history in the making. Welcome to Elon Musk 24 Hours, your premier source for the latest Tesla innovations. Today, we're taking you inside the groundbreaking developments of Optimus that are reshaping our technological future. Let's dive right in. The revolutionary capabilities of Optimus begin with its extraordinary navigation system. The robot employs a sophisticated combination of LiDAR technology and HD cameras, creating a real-time three-dimensional map within a 650-foot radius. This advanced spatial awareness means Optimus can detect and navigate around everything from furniture to small objects with unprecedented precision. But what truly sets Optimus apart is its neural network a single robust system that coordinates movement, navigation, and task management simultaneously. This AI-driven brain processes information in just 20 milliseconds, faster than a human blink. The neural network doesn't just enable quick reactions, it's constantly learning and evolving. Each new situation enhances its capabilities, making Optimus increasingly adept at handling complex environments. The robot's sensory system rivals human perception. Its advanced suite includes infrared and ultrasonic sensors for low-light operations, high-fidelity microphones for voice command recognition and sound detection, and piezoelectric touch sensors that provide human-like tactile sensitivity. This sensory fusion allows Optimus to handle tasks ranging from delicate object manipulation to